Hola fam, and welcome back to a very late episode of Latina Geek. Hello. You might have guessed we we're going to be playing Don't Starve today. The Steam sale is on, and I believe on until the 13th of July. And there is a massive array of games right now on sale that maybe you've wanted to pick up for a while. Also, in case you're curious as what the hell I've been doing the last few weeks, I probably will sneak in a little clip here. I was tempted to put our performance here, but you can catch that on the Cheer Seattle YouTube site. Okay, bye! Yeah, I've been a busy bee between my birthday, me just taking a day off to um, Pride Weekend, which is a really big deal for my cheer team. I've been throwing around some stunts. I'm sore, but I miss gaming, and we're going to get back into it, right? So, I've been dying to play this game. I heard it's very hard. It's kind of like arc level of hard um and i want to know what you guys think of it so this one's gonna be you know a little bit a little bit longer so go ahead and sit back and let's play i tested it out a little bit calm down i don't actually know what i'm doing and i think that's the fun of it generating world wrangling farming spiders and beginning a keen sense of despair this kind of reminds me of the card game. It's kind of like a storytelling card game, and I'll probably write a little annotation as to what it is later. Say, pal, you don't look so good. You better find something to eat before the night comes. Kind of see what I mean about that whole arc feeling. Right, I'm gonna just find as much resources as I can. Does that mean winner is gone? That'll teach him. Alright, I don't know how to make anything yet. I don't even... Okay, so let's just keep looking. It's all piney. Uh, the point is basically not to die, and right now I'm looking for food. Ooh, berry bush! Hey, hey, hey! Got ourselves some berries. Flint makes fire. Remember that, guys. Let's see. Can't make anything yet. I know I'm very quickly trying to jump into it just because I've heard... The horror stories from my friends <laughs> about this game. I really like the layout. Yeah, so when you're choosing something, uh, you kind of have to be... You have to be picky. And you also have to let him do his thing. Get grass. Looking for carrots. I must lead to the kingdom of Bunnymen. I'm gonna keep looking around this place. So so far I think the most valuable is gonna be the flint and the berries. My stomach, my heart, and my brain are okay for now. Hey. Build. Cool. Yeah, so, so far, this is very similar to Ark. You kind of getting that? Alright. Okay. I think I can... Nope, not yet. I can't build a weapon yet. But... I could probably attract the bunny. How are we doing? How are we doing? Ooh, okay. So far, we have... I'm gonna make an axe. And let's... See if we can clop down some trees. 
I can see... I can see, like, the levels on my stomach going down. That's just a fair warning. I'm gonna pick the carrot. Let's see. I'm gonna see if I can find... <laughs> hey, that's what I want to do. Chop, chop. Mm, I think I can make another light. Alright, let's see if there's any... Anything I can build right now. Not yet. Okay. Oh, I didn't know I could do that. Look. Oh, did you guys see that? How I could switch perspective? Alright. Alright, I'm not fast enough for the care uh, for the birds yet, so that's fine. Okay, so let's see here. I need to get more flint. Ooh. I need more flint. I can make more fire. I need grass for that. Okay. That's fine. So yeah, it's it's we're starting off very very much like Minecraft very arc ish, which you put me in survival mode. I'll figure it out. Okay, let's see here. Okay, we can make a f campfire. Promising. Sweet. Alright. Just gonna chop this bitch down. Again. I don't like this though because this leaves me very vulnerable where I am. Yeah, I don't have much in <laughs> way of fire left. It's not going to last you a whole night. You got spoiled in that retrospect. Let's see. I need more saplings to do that. A safer, more efficient light. Oh man, yeah. Do I want to do that? Do I want to do that? I do that for now. I don't have a lot of time, I know that. <laughs> I can't do that. You're gonna have to, bud. Woo! Oh, thank heavens! Light! I survived the first night! I'm not getting cocky about that. That'll teach him. Woo!
Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. I just have no way of building shelter yet. This is nuts. Uh, trap. Cool. Take that, nature. I'm just chopping down all your trees. Hey. I got to equip myself my brand spanking new There we go. Golden nugget. Oh. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Swap. Alright. I can't pick up any more stuff. Nuts. That just means I gotta build more stuff, right? Right, right, right. Science machine. Unlock new crafting tools. So I need more rocks than I do probably anything else. That frees, frees up some space. Whoa, slow down, Becca. Sorry. Sometimes it takes a little while to get out of cheerleader mode. Alright. What else can we build? This, I need two more saplings. And then I can create a trap. The more that you build stuff, the quicker you progress. Alright. Stop. Cool. Alright, so that means that I can build theoretically this. Ha <laughs> ha Yeah! We just opened up. Calm down. Okay, we just opened up a whole trifecta of stuff. That's awesome. Alright, this gets me hyped. This means we can build more stuff. Magic that we're on the right path here, kiddos. Okay. Alright. What I have to do is build a trap if I want to truly get this bunny. Oh gosh. Okay. What do I do to need to get this one going? I need 12 rocks. Which is a lot of sinking rocks. Alright. Ooh. Alright. So, all right, what was that? Redefine. <gasps> Ooh, okay, so that means I get some more uh, spaces, some more. Build a sign. Cool, 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 cool. Rad, rad. Ooh, structures also can mean houses. Boards. Yeah, so I, I'm ideally I'm trying to build a house. We'll see. Uh cool. Okay. Now to equip myself. 
with the torch I just built. That is odd. Oh, here we go. Okay. Hey, carrot. I'm looking for is more rocks. Those seem to be much more rare. <laughs> Look at his little run! Yeah, this is as fast as he goes. Let's see. Can I make another one? Should I make another? I probably should. Over here. Yay, yay! Ooh. No, not my light! Let's see. I don't have any more green. That's what the flowers are for. I was wondering if they were useful at all. Alright, uh, by the way, if you can hear the whirring of my fan in the back, I apologize. Right now, it's hot as balls in Seattle. Uh, 70 degrees for us is, is far too hot than any of us are used to. Yesterday was 96 in the parade. But we got through it. Wonderful goods. Okay. Anything else I can build yet? Gotta keep gathering those supplies, kids. This light does not play around. Like, uh, let's see. Ooh, ooh, that's how we find a map. <laughs> Alright. It's so dark. Ah! Cool. Alright. I was very, very worried about this. But I'm starting to kind of get the hang of what's going on. I always say that right before I die, right? Like, history has shown. Um, I need rocks, guys. I need him real bad. Alright. Better than you than me, bucko. Okay, where are we at? You are here. Is there anything I can build in the meantime? I haven't- okay, I have two axes already. What is this? Something I'm already equipped with. I'm actively looking for rocks right now. more grass. More grass is going to give me a better a better campfire here. Especially since the nights come very quickly. Okay. Mm -hmm. Fire pit is what I mean. Whoops. I don't know about you guys when it comes to games or when I'm playing survival stuff. I tend to kind of stay in the same area to play it safe. Just me. I 
I see rocks. Let's see, where is my other... Yay me! Okay. <laughs> I drop you guys. That's awesome, because that means I can build a nicer... Um, Thing to equip myself with when it gets dark. Oh, hey! Alright, this is exactly what I wanted. Okay, I guess I don't need that. I'm gonna go back into the woods, the area. Ooh, I need food. Okay, I'm gonna build a nice little fire pit right here. Cool. Ooh, some rocks. I would need at least some more pine for that. So let's re equip ourselves with our axe and build another guy. Hey, stop that. Can I just say chopping is really weird right now for some reason? There we go. That's a cool little indicator that we can start building stuff. I like that. I do really genuinely enjoy this game right now. <laughs> also because I'm not sucking horrifically at it. Alright, let's see here. Whoa. That opens our possibilities up just a little bit more. Hey. Ding ding. Magical stuff, vesicle stuff, jellico cats. Mm, nah. Okay, cool. Uh, pine cone? Hey, I didn't know that. Oh, hi. Ah. Ooh, what a thunk. Take that, nature.
cool. I'm building... Oh, okay. I think I understand this now. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Alright then, well I built a walls. Hey! <laughs> Made it to day four, guys. Alright, I do have a trap. I don't know why I didn't realize that until just now. Maybe there'll be a rabbit hole near us. Hmm, not even, huh? Hmm. All right, I guess that one sleeps during the day. Cool. Thanks, rocks. You're the best around. Cool. Yeah, I'm so good at hunting. Alright, picking up rocks, getting ourselves organized. Maybe I'll be able to make uh, a bi <laughs> a bigger hay wall. You guys hear that? Hey, a gold nugget. Neat. Nice. So nicely squared. Okay. So we are getting some stuff gradually. See, I want to make more of a hay wall. I got some new in here. Wait, why would I need a lightning rod? I mean, I guess why wouldn't you need a lightning rod, right? What does this do? I can harness the heavens. I actually don't know what it's for. Protection from strikes. Oh. Can I move it? That's why. All right. So I can die by... My hunch was correct. I can actually die by <laughs> lightning and thunder and all that. I can't move it once it's set. Ah, uh, nuts. All right. Alright, well I need rocks then, don't I? Let's see. There you go. Still doing pretty good on the axe. You have to let the first action finish before the second one. It's not like The Sims where you can kind of set a whole bunch of actions all together. You kind of have to keep that in mind. Alright. I gotta get some food in me.
Well. Maybe my trap to work. All right, that way I'm not dying. Do you see my stomach starting to shrivel up? It's no good. Let's go out and get some food. Wait. I huh. wonder if I could light it on fire. Ha! <laughs> hey, cool. Okay. buddy all right let's see here I got to get some food in me Alright, nothing crazy new yet. I do have to start chopping down some more wood though. Truly time to find some food. Seeds I can eat in the meantime. They're not super filling. So do you like that I'm just a dude with a beard running around? Look up from a prey. Thanks, birdies. Alright. What is that? Investigate serious deer pile. I mean, animal. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. So far, I haven't run into a lot of food. It's concerning. What is that? What is that? I don't want to die by that. Whatever that is. I don't know what that is. Nope. I'm not dying because of that. Okay. A sinkhole? Ha, dog. 
maybe there's fish. Maybe I won't uh, die. <laughs> How are you guys liking this game so far? I think it's swell. And I'm not just biased. I, I have been dying to play this game for a while. I know a lot of my buds have been talking about it. Um, but it's very much like Ark where you have to sort of be able to circumnavigate. Where you're going. Okay, so it looks like this might just be Woo! One of those instances where I'll have to find a light source, light it on fire, and uh, figure it out. This is an excellent opportunity, but I currently don't really have You are here. Uh oh. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, oh! Oh no! I'm gonna die, guys! This is how it happens. Uh, what killed me? What killed me? What was it? Uh, well, I got cocky. As I do, guys, uh, you can pick up uh, Don't Starve in the Steam uh, Steam store. It is currently like four bucks or something. So go pick it up. Go support your local indie developers. I hope that you enjoyed this episode, and I will definitely be playing a little more of this later. I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, like and subscribe and share with your pals if you're enjoying this. One last thing I totally forgot to mention is that True Seattle is raising funds for the Lambert House. It provides housing as well as uh, other job opportunities for queer uh, as well as questioning youth. We have five days left to raise as much money as we can and we're shooting for uh, about 10k this year. So anyway, guys, if you are so inclined, feel free to donate below. Uh, send love to your queer brothers and sisters because it is still Pride Month and catch you on the flippity flop. Bye!